Yo, y'all know what it is, y'all know what it ain't. But did y'all know Queso, the young man that you see right here, the law abiding citizen who ain't do nothing to nobody. Did y'all know he pretty much the Florida King Von, the way the media trying to portray it. But did y'all know his daddy, bro, who's who the whole world was trying to scream was so loyal for going to go pick his son up after a murder. He was testifying on his own flesh and blood. How you gonna sit in a witness stand? How you gonna get on the stand and testify against your sperm cell, bro? You looking at somebody that would came from your testicles. You know what I mean? I mean you going to turn informant on them? Regardless of if they did it or not. Honestly, it's sad. It's such a sad situation because I don't want to get too federal, but I talked about this before on, on Truth Teller interview. I had a friend I need to go slide with me. He got scared, said he, his stomach hurt, and he was on the toilet. So I called my daddy. My daddy slid with me without getting into too much. My daddy bust that move with me. Yes, he did. And it's sad to see that I thought, for one, you know, black people, black men, we don't really have enough fathers in the household. So for a young man who actually grew up with his father, regardless of how his life ended up taking, of the, what life path he ended up taking or whatever, it's still sad to see that even in the black community, the fathers are not there for their son totally. My dad was always there for me through addiction, through sobriety, no matter what, he was always there. And it just really hurts to see Queso having to go through this. He already got the whole judicial system against him. He a black young man with dreads. He don't got no money to fight the case. And so now he got the whole world against him. He's not coming from under this. And on top of this, I did a, a story on this like six months ago. His sister got shot in the jaw for setting up a bail bondsman. Set him up to rob him. He turned around and shot her in the mouth. And the fact that it just seemed like it's just getting worse and worse for your boy, man. Um... I guess just prayers go out to Queso. Regardless, you know, I know how y'all feel. If somebody committed a murder, then y'all should feel this way. Y'all shouldn't be saying free him. I'm not, you know, I, I understand I'm in the media now, so I'm just keeping my mouth shut on that. But I don't wish jail on nobody. You know, get in the comments section. Let me know what y'all think below. I'm gone.